this has been so cool because I really want to get out so Liverpool was calling my name and so I've been summoned and I am now Liverpool so anyway I'm on the old docker it's quite cloudy today it's quite cold out today which is the first time forever because it's been like really hot recently but it's cold out today so Dock today, so it's like really quiet out there. Like, it's literally, well, there's a few down there, but not as much as there is normal. Like, normally, at Hobbit Dock, it's like heaving, like loads of people, but this time around, it's like really quiet. I'm not sure what to say, at least it's like 11 o'clock in the morning on a Sunday or whatever. But it's so usually trying to like navigate through people because like people like stop in the middle of like the path and you don't know how to be on the path basically. But it's actually really nice out today. Okay, here's the okay. So my hair looks like this because I got the anti antipretzel, which by the way I like lovely. I love anti antipretzel, so I can't wait to try this one. Um, but also I love one classy pretzel boo thing. I got a nice flow of that extractor fan warm air. Um, it really hit me right in the face, that's all well, the extractor fan blow air thing and mess up all the hair. So at least it was warm air. So I need to find a place to sit now and eat this pretzel. I want to eat something, I've got eight on morning. Hi, I'm back now from Liverpool. Liverpool went really good. We've been back for ages now, which I've never released really a vlog, but I had tea and a bacon sandwich and um, a sponge pudding, so that's pretty good. Anyway, I'm here now and I'm gonna get so there's a bit of a story, so I was like really needed a toilet. Um, I was needing a bathroom. And one thing about me is that I hate taking public bathrooms because it's not because like dirty or sort of like unsanitary or anything like that. But so it's like huge fear, which is like a really strange fear and a really strange sort phobia. Um, I've even like tried to search this phobia up and there's no such like, phobia apparently. Um, but I have a huge fear of men's urinals for some reason. I don't know why. I've always had it since I was a child and no, I've, had, like, I've, I've had like many fears when I was a child that I seemed to be able to shake off but not this one where I have a huge fear of men's urinals and it's not the urinal itself um, because normally if, I'm, if I go to the bathroom it's like a waterless urinal or a urinal that hasn't flushed then I'm alright but the thing is I, just, I have a huge fear of urinals that act that, like automatically flush so I think in America it's like different because you press something to flush it so it's like 
I expected, but in the UK, the urin men's urinals in the UK, they automatically flush after a certain amount of time, or if someone's peed, obviously the sensor goes off and it flushes them, but, but I also have a fear of like, automatic flushing toilets as well for some reason, but anyway, it's basically, yeah, I have a huge fear of, like, urinals, because they look ugly, for one, like, you got to, like, dome that's like mounted on the wall and it looks like really ugly um so that's one thing and um, it's like just uh just like sewing you just like you know, when you walk in the bathroom but then another the thing is that like, they automatically flush as well so that could be like a silence like bathroom that's like silence and then this ugly looking thing which is already scary looking and ugly all of a sudden makes this like horrible squelching noise and it doesn't like flush like a normal toilet either you know because obviously you press the lever and water just like go sound like the sound of water like a tap basically but like, usually it mends your urinals like when they flush it makes like horrible squelching noise so I could be stood in the bathroom then all of a sudden I hear that like, horrible squelching flushing noise but I'm gonna actually see what this phobia is it's basically a fear of like automatic flushing urinals so I hate I have a fear of the sound of flushing urinals and what's weird about it as well is that if I'm in the bathroom and someone else is in with me then I'm all right like it can flush and I'll be all right with that but if I'm like on my own in the bathroom then that's when it puts the fear of God in me so I'm not sure I think it's like that's like so sort of theory that it's just like zombie and it's gonna come out to get me because no one's in there to shield me even though I know it's not a zombie that's gonna get me but if you've got what I mean well first I'm gonna search um fear of automatic flushing toilets because I know a lot of people suffer from that okay this is the first thing that comes up fear of automatic flushing toilets this is a pretty normal childhood fear Okay, so it's meant to be a fear when I was a child, not when I'm like 20. Oh, it's because like normally when young children have a fear of like automatic toilets, that they have a fear of like flushing themselves down the toilet, so that's sort of like, I don't know, feeling. Um, but it's such a fear for automatic flushing urinals. No, all it is is just like fear of self flushing toilets. So I guess like urinals are self flushing, so I guess it ties them together really. So, what's it called though? Okay, I don't think there's an actual sort of name for it. I'm trying to search for it, but. Um, no, there's like no sort of name for it, so I think my official title is I have a fear of automatic flushing toilets, so yeah. 